concrete jungle, cemented through centuries of churning that melting pot of culture. My hometown has different social classes and ethnicities. We all have different ways of doing things, but there's still symmetry. Shaped up and shipped out. Gentrified and ripped out the heart of community, elderly and history. Derelict and decay, that's what they used to say. Regenerate and transform, that's where we are today. Today is different than it used to be. There's no such thing as job security, not to mention mental illness, depression and anxiety. The prices on the houses keep on rising. And like a boat, I guess I'm meant to float along with them. The trouble is, it's no surprise to see these waters drowning folk like me. Government taking much of austerity, now they're talking regeneration. Is that really end elevation? I don't know. Removals of council flats and growth of luxury apartments. The dispersion of communities who tell tales such as these. Call it regeneration, I call that positive politics. I don't really care what they call it. I just want to know where the profit is and who's profiting from it. I wonder what it'll feel like on my knees. The revolution is broken. The words are stuck in your throat and all you've got in your pocket are scraps of metal with bundles of hope beginning to rot. We walk the city 
for hours trying to rearrange our skin to the rivers and roads and maps on the back of it. Into the urban, into basements of smoke and sound, into the dark places to my soul and defining moments. Gaps you find the stories, whispers of history in the grout and family in the gutters. are crowded with things that were never meant to be there, but through a flood they were washed away until they had nothing else to hold on to but each other. A miscellaneous island of precious debris that has come together to make a community, whether we realise it or not. celebrate our colorful utopia a smuggles board of culture so be kind have some prayers of things i was told as an infant now you're involved in that thinking so don't see how you could loathe others pigments and i noticed some instincts we could grow where we're living when we endorse the force that is multiculturalism
Christ is not dead, but is living in us, and will be alive in the future, which we are now helping to make.